Miss Biscuit, hello. I see you're ready for your cranial nerve exam. Yes, so it says here that you come in for a general checkup as well as just a basic cranial nerve. Okay, very good. All right, is it all right if I have my trainee here? I'm going to have them watch as I do the exam today. Are you comfortable with that? Right here? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, good, good. Let's sit down for a second here. <laughs> Let's sit down. Your little claws stuck. Okay. So, I'm looking through your records here. And it says that you go by several names. Is this true? Okay, so it looks like you go by Biscuit, or B-Squee, or Squee-Squee, or even Stinky Butt. Is that okay? Should we call you Stinky Butt today? You'd rather just Biscuit? Okay. So, first thing that we're going to do, if that's okay, is we're going to check your face muscles. All right. So we of course want to greet the patient, make sure everything's okay, um, and then move straight on because they get impatient. Okay. So <clears throat> can you look at me, please? Can you look at me? Okay, good enough. We want them to look at us, but if they're just not feeling it, it just doesn't happen sometimes and we have to work around it. Okay. Okay. So can I see your face muscles, please? Okay, good. Can you smile for me, please? Good. And frown for me, please. Very good. Okay. Very good. I'm going to feel the muscles in your back here. Make sure everything's okay. All right. So next, I just need to feel your muscles here. We need to squeeze to make sure that the muscles are doing okay. Okay, and I'm just going to check your thyroid. There can often be issues with our thyroid and we are unaware, so I need to make sure that it's not okay, swollen. Okay, feels okay. Good. And there's also thyroids all around our body, so I need to check here, okay, here, okay, very good, okay. So next, Miss Bisqui, I need to check your heart rate. Okay, yes, we're gonna check your heart rate, okay? Good girl, good girl, sit down, check your heart rate, okay. Breathe. It's okay. I'm just checking your heart. Okay. If the patient um, is making a lot of noises, it can be hard to hear the heart. But you just have to concentrate. Okay. Okay. Check the head as well. The heart rate in the head. See what I'm doing here? Make sense to you? Okay. Good. Good, Gita. Good, Gita. All right. Now let's check that breathing of yours, all right? Take a deep breath. Good. And deep breath. Good. Good girl. Okay, and right here, I'm gonna check, okay? Good, so I actually would have preferred that you took a deeper breath, but that should be fine. I know that you have a little kid of asthma, and um, it can be hard for you. How has um, your prescription on your, your inhaler been? Has your inhaler been working for you? Yeah? Okay. All right. So next, um, I do want to check your nerve sensitivity. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this to touch your face and you tell me if it is hard or soft. Okay? Ready? Boop. 
good, okay? Boop. Very good. And boop. Good job. Okay, what about I have hair on my face? That's fine. Okay, what about like right? Boop. Was that soft or hard? Okay. So often our patients, um, they have other things in mind, but we just have to redirect them and remind them that they're in the middle of an exam. Okay, remember, soft or hard? Soft or hard? Hmm? Soft? Okay, what about this right here? Is that soft? Is it soft? Okay, what about right here? Good girl. And it's soft. Good job. Okay. Very good. So, I was going to put on gloves, but I think that maybe you're just a little bit, um, you're a little bit antsy today, so I'm maybe not going to do gloves. I am going to check your eyes and your ears here, okay? Okay. Click. Now I'm going to look into your eyes here. In this sense, often we don't get to, um, look straight into their eyes. Sometimes we have to look from the sides. Okay, and your other eye. Very good. Okay, so I'm just looking inside the patient's ears now. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Oh, okay. So it looks pretty good. This ear looks great too. Okay, what about this part here? Can I look right here? Good girl. And right here? Good. So, is your hearing okay? How are you feeling about your hearing? Huh? Has it been good? <sighs> well, we're gonna have to check those eyes a little bit more because I saw something that um, was potentially concerning. Hey, missed it. All right, can you do me a favor and tell me which line you can see here? Oh, okay. Messing up our area a little bit, that's fine. Can you tell me which line you see here? Can you see this line here? Yep, yeah? okay. What about um, this line here? Can you see this line? Right over here? They often don't um, look with their eyes, but they will, they will let you know. Um, here, right here. Can you see this line, the third line? Just read that third line if, if any of those, those letters or words make sense to you. Okay, what about the fourth line? Does the fourth line have any meaning to you? What about the fifth line? Can you see the fifth line? Okay, so it seems that this one is illiterate, unfortunately. Yeah, so it didn't say in the file that you were illiterate, but that's okay because I'll put that in there now, no problem. I'm just gonna write that down. No, no, it's okay, it's fine. Um, many of our clients or patients are um, illiterate. Can't read. Yeah. It's okay. All right, let's move on, shall we? Okay. Can you tell me how many fingers I'm holding up? Okay, tell me how many fingers. How many fingers am I holding up? Okay, how about now? How many fingers? How many fingers am I holding up? Okay. What about now? How many fingers am I holding up? Okay, so we got you looking. How many fingers? Okay. So she also potentially can't count either. Um, and that is no problem. That's completely fine. That's completely fine. So tell me when my, let's do f field of view, okay? Field of view test. I make sure. Okay, so meow when my fingers leave your field of view. Let me know. Meow when they leave. No, you're supposed to keep your... Uh, sorry, I didn't tell them. So you do have to let them know. So look forward right here. Can you look at my, my assistant here? And tell me when my fingers leave your field of view. Okay? Okay, you're not supposed to... um. You're not supposed to look at my finger. You're actually supposed to look forward at my um, wonderful assistant here. Okay, so I'm looking forward, please. Let me know when it leaves your field of view. Good job. Okay, you can tell me anytime now. Anytime now? Okay, 
So I'm just going to assume that um, it did leave your field of view and you noticed just fine. I'm just going to write down that that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Very good. Okay, so I'm going to look through your fur because you have had history of fleas, right? Is that true? It's nothing to be ashamed of. You had fleas, right? Yeah, we've all had fleas, okay? So I'm just going to look through your fur here. Okay, looking through your fur. <laughs> Looks very good. Okay, I don't see any fleas. Okay, good job. I'm just going to look through. So tell me, how has your day been? Have you been doing anything fun? Yeah? I see. Okay. Oh, pardon me. I'm just gonna look through like this. Okay. And I'm gonna look through down here. Okay. See if you have any fleas. Yeah. seeing any. I, I agree. But I just want to be very thorough. I want to be very, we need to be very thorough because often the fleas will be in one area but not in the other. Okay. Okay, here I'm just going to check over here. Okay. Good. Good job. Check down here. such a good job on your general exam today. Yeah. Check here. Very good. Okay. Alright. Next, um, I'm going to check your neck muscles to see if they're okay. So, is that okay? What about that? How's that? Okay. A little bit of... Was there a little bit of pain? No? You were fine? Alright, that's good. That's very good. Okay, so I'm just gonna look at my... Yeah, okay, so we did the eye test. Very good. All right, very good. Um, I will need a saliva sample. So just open your mouth, say ah. This part is often very hard because they don't know how to say ah. They only know how to say bagao or meow or meow or whatever it is. Okay, so I'm just gonna swab Good girl! Get that saliva sample. <laughs> good girl. Yep. Got a good sample. Huh. Yeah. Good kita. Um, no, let's not eat it though. Okay. So often our cats, um, <clears throat> sorry, our patients that come in here, they, um, have a sort of appetite for human flesh. So I'm just going to test that real quick. You, you don't have any urge to... Um, perhaps bite my finger off or anything like that? I knew it. I knew it. Unfortunately, this one does seem to have an appetite for human flesh. That's okay. I'm just gonna write that in your record. We're gonna, we're gonna take care of, it's okay. We're gonna take care of that for you. We're gonna take care of that for you. That's okay. We're gonna take care of that for you. Okay. So next is the colorblind test. Is that something that you'd be okay with? It's a sore spot? Okay. Have we done the test before? Yeah. And it didn't go well? I see. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, so Biscuit decided that she didn't want to be in on it anymore. And so her sister is going to fill in for the rest of this training exam. First, we need to relax the patient. Yeah. With a get us go gurt. <laughs> okay, Grady. So I did take a look at your file, and you seem to be very healthy. Okay. 
this should be a very quick exam. So you definitely want to make sure that your patient is nice and relaxed and that they are fat and happy because plump kira is a happy kira. <laughs> okay, so while you're doing that, I'm just gonna check I'm gonna check your ocular muscles here. All right, I'm gonna check your ocular muscles here. Oh, okay, yes. All right. And the other one. Good girl. Okay, I'm gonna check your ears here. second here. Okay, so do you by chance see any of these lines? Can you tell me which line you see? Okay, I understand. This one is also a little better. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, gravy. So I'm just gonna check your muscles here. Also lie down in very odd positions during the day. Yep. Okay. I can work that out if you no problem here. I'm just gonna take this and we're gonna. Yep. There we go. Oh, here's some more. You want some more? Okay. I'm just gonna get that all out. There we go. Very good. Is it feeling better at all? can feel your muscles. Okay, good. Feeling better. All right. Yeah, good job. Okay, up here as well. All right. So, there you go. A little bit more. There you go. Okay. So next we're going to measure your ears. Okay, let's see if they were the same length as they were last year. We'll measure your forehead here. Yeah. Okay. And your kira shoulders. Measure your kira shoulders. Okay. Good. Alright. Measure your kira's eyes. No, that's not. Your eyes. Very good. Okay. And your whiskers as well. We need to measure your whiskers. Okay, very good. Okay. Yeah. So, you seem to be very healthy, Miss Gravy. But, let's see here. I'm just going to measure your, this part here. You are indeed a happy kidda. I can tell by the weight here. Yep, you are indeed a happy kidda. Can I take a look at your paws here? Can I take a look? Many of our patients uh, don't love when we touch their paws, but of course, you know, once they're fat and happy, uh, they allow us to take a look. Okay, so I'm just going to look at your paws here. Okay, and your other palm. Can I see? No? Okay, no touch. That's fine. Here, just a little bit more. Come here. Just a little bit more. You just gotta push it up. Very good. Okay. Now, your nose. Let's look at the color of that nosy. Okay, yeah. So the color of her nose is looking quite healthy. I just checked the wetness of the nose, and it is looking good. Oh, here's a little bit more. There you go. There we go. Can you tell me how many fingers I'm holding up? OK, 
Okay, good. How many fingers? How many fingers? How, how many fingers? Okay. <sighs> it's a process for sure. Okay. All right, can you tell me what it is you're tasting? I'm just gonna check your nose here, okay? Good. Okay, and can you smell this? What does that smell like? Tuna. Good, good. Okay, now, um, what does this smell like? Human. Good. Good job. So it looks like your nose is nice and, um, nosiness. It is working. Gotta push it up, okay? Gotta push it up. There you go. There you go. There you go. Okay, so this one is a little stupid at times, but that's okay. You just show her where the food is. Okay. Now, I'd like to also check your heart rate, please. Okay. 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 Can you take a deep breath for me, please? Deep breath. Good, okay. Deep breath. Good, okay. And one more. Very good, okay. Here, just a little bit more. Okay, so the tuna treat seems to have come to an end. So this may be the end of our cranial nerve exam with Miss Gravy here. Okay, you can just take a look at that. Okay, there seems to be an issue with uh, this part of your body, so I'm just gonna just gonna. Oh, okay. So often our clients leave us before we are able to fully treat them. And this is okay. Um, we're used to this. It is unfortunate, but we do what we can. We care for our patients. And it seems that these two, <clears throat> both biscuit and gravy, are relatively healthy. Gravy uh, was able to get um, treated for that thing. Okay. So I'm just going to write down a few notes for next time. Okay. Right. Good. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Okay. Do you have any questions about today? Any questions about how to work with patients? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, unfortunately, that question I won't be able to answer. You're going to have to look in your syllabus. Yeah. Yeah, it's all in the syllabus. Mm-hmm. Right? And if you have any other questions that aren't in the syllabus, please be sure to email me. Thank you so much. Yep. Thank you for joining me today. Mm-hmm. <laughs>